In tonight's Healthier Me, you might not realize that one of your nervous habits might actually be good for you. Researchers at the University of Missouri studied adults who fidget, and what they found might surprise you. Kent Fattis has more. Research shows sitting at your desk in front of a computer for an extended period of time is not good for your health. Reduced blood flow to the legs could lead to cardiovascular disease. But did you know that a nervous habit that is annoying to some could actually get the blood flowing again? Researchers at the University of Missouri say fidgeting or toe tapping could lead to better health. What we found is as an average uh, people perform about 250 taps per minute and that resulted in an increase in blood flow during the actual fidgeting. University of Missouri researchers studied 11 healthy young men and women before and after three hours of sitting. Researchers surprisingly found fidgeting increased blood flow enough to prevent a decline in arterial function. We believe that any type of leg movement um, will be beneficial to the arteries of the lower limbs. Good news for MU student Nathan Wynn who is a constant fidgeter. As long as you're not annoying your friends or bothering other people and if you can get potential health benefits out of it, why not do it? But Padilla says fidgeting is no substitute for walking and exercise. Perhaps in situations where we're stuck in the office or on an airplane, fidgeting or life movement may be a good alternative to preserve like vascular function. The bottom line, any movement is better than no movement. From the University of Missouri, I'm Kent Faddis reporting for NBC News. The MU fidgeting study was recently published in the American Journal of Physiology, Heart and Circulatory Physiology. Later in sports, the first preseason football polls are released and the Bison are in a familiar spot. Alex Egan has the details. But first, are you an AT&T customer? If so, you could be getting a refund. Stay tuned.